Estoy muy preocupada porque Charlie no tiene trabajo, pero yo confío en Dios que Charlie está trabajando bien duro para lograr lo que él quiere. She is a bit worried that Charlie does not have a job, but she has faith in God and she knows that Charlie has been working hard to achieve his goals. ¿Y qué le desea Charlie? Charlie, te deseo lo mejor. Espero que el equipo que te coja te dé oportunidad para que tú puedas demostrar lo que es un buen jugador. Charlie, she wishes you the best and she hopes that the team that does choose you um, gives you the opportunity to demonstrate your skills and that you are a good player. Your family loves you a lot and you haven't let any of us down. You've been a great person, a great brother, son, friend, a great basketball player, teammate. Keep working hard and you know we have, you have our support. What is the situation right now? Not too happy about it, because last time you was signed the first day, now he's actually waiting. But I feel like it's actually good for him, because it could push him to be a better player, work harder, and to prove all his doubters that he can still contribute and still be a good player for any team. Have a crazy time for for 17 years. I've been training athletes. I've had the business open since 1999. This is what I do. Boxing, training, TRX, kettlebell, mixture of everything. Plyometrics, isometrics, a bit of everything. Well, I've trained a lot of athletes, not just basketball players, hockey players, football players, and it really helps them with conditioning, uh, all body conditioning, more uh, speed, timing, rhythm. Uh, it takes them to a whole nother level of training, I believe. It opens up a whole nother span of interior design, if you will. The cardio part, the conditioning part, the technique part. It's just an all-around workout for them. He comes in, you know, consistently. He's on a good one. He's here, he's in town. It's a good four or five days a week. You know, he's training hard. And he's been working out a lot. I mean, he's definitely changed. His, his balance has changed. His strength has definitely changed. His cardio's went through the roof. You know, his conditioning, obviously, his rhythm, his timing. The length of his arms and legs have changed. He's come a long, long way. No, he's pretty good. That's why I keep coming to him. Um, just to see how he pushes me and see how each and every day it's a different type of workout. You know, um, it's not the same stuff. You know, it's every day it's something different. And, um, just to see how much better I get every every day. I love that. That's why, that's why I keep coming back is because I see how much better I keep getting. You know, when I first started to now, it's a big difference. And um, I'm just keeping improving, so that's, that's, that's what I'm going for. I tell you what, it's been, it's, it's been a, what I like about Charlie is that most athletes, you know, I've trained in the past, crying, you know, always, <laughs> this guy's quiet and gets to it. Goes the best he possibly can, won't quit. He gets to it, no matter what challenge it is. He never knows what I'm gonna do next. Consider this your warning. Happened at the Team USA scrimmage, Paul George trying to stop a James Harden drive right wow. here. And instead the basket support stops George. It's just unfortunate, man. Um, you know, you 
hate to see that. My heart goes out to him. Um, just to see just to see that happen is it's just mind boggling. While he's going through this process, there's so much he's gonna find out about himself. There's so much he's gonna find out about his people, his peers. You're gonna see who are the people that really care about you, really there for you. I've been in that position before when I hurt my, my shoulder, uh, tore my labrum. You know, I learned a lot. You know, things happen for a reason. I think God gives, you know, the strongest soldiers the toughest battle. At the same time, it builds character. Free agency for me is still at a standstill. I'm um, still waiting, being very patient. Teams still have, you know, I think over a month, maybe two months, you know, to figure out their roster situation. So while they take their times, guy like me, you know, I have to wait. I'm